a cheval de frise. Or many of them would be a chevaux de frise. Or chevaux de frise. And uh, this is for terrainaholic who uh, attempted one of these and called them palisades. What I've done is I've got some cardboard and as you can see I've just uh, folded it with an arch there, stapled it down and put a whole bunch of grease paper down, cooking grease paper and then along the edge here I've just got some blue tack some putty wall putty you'd stick posters on your walls with and then I've got some uh, well I used uh, kebab skewer ends about uh, five centimeters long two inches long but you could use toothpicks and I'm just stacking them in the middle here so you can see how quickly this can be done I'm only using 10 but you could really just with a nice long piece of cardboard you could make very big ones very quickly so uh, I'm almost finished here, last one's place and uh, I'm just going to grab uh, some of the ones that are a little bit off there and just push them back in again not a lot to this, pretty much finished and uh, then I'm just going to push it down with a uh, old, old piece of kebab skewer there and now all I need to do is apply hot glue so you can make many of these very very quickly but the biggest problem with this method uh, is that you have to sit around for a while waiting for the hot glue to harden and uh, the reason why we have the grease paper there is because the hot glue won't stick to the grease paper I think it was Brian Gregory who told me that uh, on a, quite a few videos ago but uh, you know that's uh, very handy to have that there and pretty much now I'm just gonna have to pull these apart slightly to let the glue drip down between them and then it's just waiting 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 Got to turn on the boots of speed, just to uh, pass the time, blow on it a little bit. Blow on it a bit more. Alright, so then when it's dry, hardened, I just uh, pull out the putty, a blue tack, and uh, it's still a little bit flimsy, so we have to apply another layer of glue, but we're going to do that underneath. So all we do is flip it over, pull off the excess uh, blue tack there, flip it over, put it back on the ridge, grab the glue gun and glue down the middle again. Uh, yeah, this couldn't be any simpler. The ridge is important uh, with the cardboard because it just helps you uh, quickly place these down rather than having to put individual ones on. If you're doing hundreds of these, you'll do your head in. So uh, that's how I do a cheval de frise, terrainaholic. And uh, that's how DMG lays down the smack on your Rudy Poo candy ass. Uh, anyway, that's what happens when you take me on.